Hey, 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 royal fans, and welcome back to the channel. I'm your host, Sheldon Moon, and in today's headline, Queen Heartbreak. What would happen if the Queen is unable to perform her duties? Queen Elizabeth II has commanded the throne for 68 years in 2020, and has far exceeded the reigns of Britain's longest rulers. She also ranks amongst the world's longest reigning heads of state, and retains an active job despite her mostly ceremonial roles. However, questions frequently arise as to whether she intends to retire, and what will happen if she can no longer actively serve in her role. So what would happen if the Queen is unable to perform her duties? The Queen famously said she would serve the British public until her death, meaning she is not likely to ever retire from the role. As such, the only way she may consider stepping back is if her health should somehow interfere. While there are no indications of ill health, the Queen's advancing age comes with increased risks. According to UCL's resident constitution, units in its school of public policy, incapacitation of a monarch would cause a regency. In this case, her immediate successor would take on the role of the monarch without officially taking the position. Naturally, this would effectively place Prince Charles as king. Royal experts believe that the Queen could step down earlier than expected, but not likely as a regency. Author Robert Jobson said speculation suggests Charles could reign, but his mother would want the transition to be seamless. He said the Queen of course vowed to serve her country for the rest of her life, but it has long been speculated that Prince Charles could reign as a regent sooner than later. After all, Charles's life of public service has been part of his preparation for kingship. I am certain the Queen will want succession to occur naturally and seamlessly. The only other way for the Queen to forfeit her position would be via abdication. Experts believe that is even more unlikely than a regency, with the Queen famously declaring she would serve for her life, whether it be long or short. Other European rulers favour abdication when they reach a certain age. In the unlikely scenario she did abdicate, Prince Charles would immediately become king. Alright guys, there you have it, and that's what will happen if the Queen couldn't fulfill her role. Thank you for watching today's royal installment, I really hope you enjoyed the content. If you did, please like the video, comment on the video, and subscribe to the channel for more. Thank you for watching, and goodbye for now.